measures learning in many ways. Children in grades K to 2 learn foundational skills through a clearly defined curriculum that provides the children higher level thinking skills such as critical thinking skills along with the tools needed for oral and written expression skills. At CHP, we understand that each child learns differently and in turn, a variety of assessments are used to ensure opportunities for all learners. Teachers at CHP are constantly assessing the whole child and monitor both academic and social skills on an ongoing basis. At the start of each new school year, we begin with a diagnostic pre-assessment to see what the children already know and focus on, focus on areas that need review and in turn this gives the teachers a starting point to begin teaching. Throughout the year, teachers use both formative and summative assessments to measure learning. A formative assessment is an evaluation tool that allows teachers to access students' knowledge of a topic while they are learning it. Examples include an exit slip, asking a question about material taught the day before, notebooks, drawings, and polls. The results give the teacher instant feedback and help the teacher drive instruction for that particular topic or lesson. Summative assessments are assessments that evaluate student learning at the end of a chapter or unit that measures how the students did in reference to the objective or benchmark of that unit of study. Examples of summative assessments include chapter tests, exams, unit projects. Starting in first grade, along with regular chapter testing, students take cumulative exams each trimester. CHP also measures learning at year-end using the Terra Nova standardized test. Developed by McGraw-Hill, it is a nationally normed standardized achievement and cognitive test. It is correlated to textbooks and content written for each grade, and the questions are general and test for understanding. These are some of the ways that we measure learning at CHP.